Hi. Oh. All right. So, Miranda and Aaron, it's your wedding day, and uh, I put a little bit of makeup on to motivate me. Well, first it was to look a little more weak, but also to motivate me not to be emotional uh, making this video. Uh, and I know part of what was to be my role as a maid of honor was uh, a speech at the reception. Uh, but since I can't be there to make it, there's no pressure to be funny now because I can be emotional now because I won't be there. <laughs> but. I'm wearing makeup so it motivates me not to be super emotional though. I'm really happy for you guys and you know I'll have a selfish moment that I am sad that I can't be there. This was not something not any of us expected would happen that I couldn't make it to your wedding but that's just how it's worked out but right now I'm like really happy um, for you guys. Okay I'm realizing this is going to be tough. Um, I'll do the cliche thing where everybody has to talk about their friends, but like you, Brandon, you and I, you know, we met over food, we met over a messed up hot dog, and we have bonded over food ever since. Um, so I hope on this day you're being fed, because <laughs> I've been to weddings, the brides and the grooms barely eat, so I hope you're being fed on this day. But. Um, I just wanted to just express uh, how happy I have, you know, and how privileged it's been for me to watch your journey as a couple. To even be a part of this like planning process for this wedding, uh, that's not something I ever took for granted. Um, you two are one of the few couples, few strongest couples that I know. and. I say this knowing that you know at some point you Aaron you and I did not always see eye to eye but watching your relationship and seeing you guys go through the good the bad the in-betweens I've just seen it unfold into a strong relationship you've come out of everything just stronger and that's something a lot of people wish for and you have that and I feel very honored and privileged to have even to have even been a part of this planning process for the wedding and to have almost been there to have almost been there um, moving forward I know you guys can only get stronger and as one of your closest friends right now and somebody that's like I've always considered you a sister so I'm just going to address it that way like as a sister I can like be rest assured and I can be at peace knowing that you're happy and you're both happy um, because that's that's a rare thing for a lot of people so yeah uh, although I can't be there I do hope and pray and wish that this day is full of blessings and you see just how loved you are by all the people you are surrounded by and I'm sure you're all going to be sending me pictures and videos and I look forward to seeing them all um, and I hope you just have a really 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 good day <laughs> so here's one thing that I'm really grateful for I'm grateful that you made me a part of the original thing um, that you thought there was that much value in our friendship that I could be a part of you know I could be a part of your lives uh, I'm really grateful for that and the, like being a part of the original thing is even more valuable than it already was before and I want to thank you for that so um, yeah that's it so while I can't be there and I wish I was there, but I'm there in spirit. But it doesn't mean I still can't make a toast. So I'm going to make a toast. And uh, I don't have wine, I have juice. But here is to a life with God at the center. Here is to a life full of happiness for you guys, full of blessings, full of joy, full of support through the good and bad. And to the girls, please, take care of them on the wedding day and let's also continue to show the support that we've showed through all this process um yes so 
Cheers to you, Miranda and Aaron. I will see you guys very soon.